Hello everyone, welcome to the Advancement Centre and welcome to the world of magic and miracles where once again we take ourselves above even the elevated platform of living that we have trained ourselves into to a place where our communication is automatic to where our own engine turns on and the communication of the stars takes over and allows us to open our own individual channel into the world of our creator and back into the physical world so that you're in more than two places at the one time you are everywhere looking back at the focus that you've made here on earth at the same time you are able to look into the world of your creator and feel the difference in just telling yourself that you're there. This ability belongs to each and every one of you. And your individual communication and connection into this broadcast has allowed you to be totally independent and isolated from everything except your personal and specific world. Your unique character is now starting to appear in the physical world. And it surprises you a little at how your format is always perfect. How each time you have an experience, you come out the other end saying, well, that was a little flat. Oh, that was great but so you always know exactly what should be and what shouldn't be because it is your world and you are the master of that world we've seen many incidences where we can contact people out of nowhere and feel it and know that we have to move or know that we are going to get a phone call or we know that there's some bad influence in the room all these experiences show us that we are much more than what we thought we were and we have more facilities available to us than what we register in our everyday life so as you connect into the field that we all make You find you have an individual field that belongs to you one that is never affected by anything unless you allow it to be affected one that you don't you don't have to look after it's always perfect and it's always in direct communication with your creator that single voice that comes to you out of nowhere always has the correct answer and for many years I've related the experience where I asked for the answer to everything and with a power that almost collapsed me on the ground I was told at all times think of me and nothing else that is the solution to everything that's quite a mystery it's taken many years for me to get to the point where I can say that was a good thing to say at the time but now I'm there I don't even have to know about it because everything runs on simplicity and the simplest thing is just to be where you are in the presence of your creator and in your physical world and experiencing the sparkle that is all around you and the and the highlight that happens because you have a glow you have a glow that people can see that you can't pick up in a picture you have a characteristic that you transmit all the time even if you put on a false front 
people know because you're transmitting the full truth of who you are, what you're about and what gifts you're about to give to the world. You look at a young child and you say, she's going to be a dancer. This one's going to be a doctor or a professor or a golfer. And they've got that big sign that you can see but it doesn't appear anywhere in the visual plane. So you have vision of what's transmitted to you through that language that I call the language of the stars. And it's here on earth as well as out there in the unknown where we're really enjoying the exploration. So now we can look back into the physical world and see everything quite differently. Not an opinion, not a way of looking at anything. It's looking from all the dimensions that are open to you. All the millions of sparkly dimensions that just look like Tinkerbell sparkles around your being. They're all focused. Like a hologram projector into your body. And they each contain an enormous cross-section of new parts of your character, new possibilities in your being. As they each switch on, you feel the power start to happen in your body. Everything feels normal and better. And the sparkles, as they move, generate power, enormous power that you're about to use. Simeon mentioned that we we're going to explore all these different energies and powers and capabilities and gifts that you have for the world. And nobody has the same thing. They're all different. Everything is different and, every, and everything is new. So to have an interest in what everybody else is presenting shows you your uniqueness shows you their magnificence and brings a value system into the world that has nothing to do with the dollar, has nothing to do with measuring how many units you got in an exam. It has nothing to do with how many years you've been doing something. It's a value system that belongs to each one of you that you're fully aware of, that's continually changing every minute. And you understand that, even though you say I don't, you don't understand. But you know your, your reaction to something that's unfair, to something that is not a real measure, to something that was made up to say, well, on this date, I sat for an exam 30, 40 years ago, therefore I'm better than you. These things disappear in our value system, the new value system that we're bringing to the world, that there is a standard beyond anything we've ever experienced in the physical world. This is your gift. And that standard applies to your world and when you use magic and miracles, it works in every world. Because magic and miracles is the format of the combined language of the universe, of your ability, your capability, and your signature, and your authority in every world and every dimension. So lately we've been experiencing the fact that the dimensions are actually open. 
They're not divided off like they normally are. And as you attempt to create more dimensions, to close off from other people, you will find they're more transparent. You can't block a conversation as easily now as you used to be able to. You can have a conversation in the middle of 50 people just with someone that's across the way from you and you can capture that conversation so that nobody else knows what you're talking about. Well now, with our multi-dimensional advancement, you'll find that everybody knows. They don't take that much notice. But if you mention one thing about what you said, the whole conversation will come back to them. So we all know what one another are talking about because we've opened the dimensions. We've come in from our origin and walked through all the structures that were put in place many thousands of years ago. And as we walk through them, we distributed our gifts and melted anything that was not balanced. We went out from this world and came in in a different direction so that we're not going back through the same holes that we went out. And we do that a million times a day. So we know we're everywhere and so does everybody else. We know that if we need to, we can just change our focus to somewhere else and that's where we'll be. We don't practice that very often, but it happens at special times. When you get a sincere message that someone needs you, they'll feel you, they'll see you, and it's real. As we develop further, it won't be special occasion it'll be any time that it's necessary any time in any moment because we're starting to play in the world of our creator where everything is new all the time where we don't ever have a shortage of anything including the intelligence to know what's happening this intelligence is a package that comes with every moment. And it's uniquely yours. And for some reason, you understand things that are not even explained to you. You understand things that have never been seen on the earth. And you understand from a different way through a different set of inputs and outputs. Just like your vision the vision you have now is so simple, it's not just through your eyes. It appears all around you. It's like you're in the hologram. And it comes in through the trillions of inputs that come into your being and into your body. And it doesn't come through your brain. It comes through the field that surrounds you. And that field presents itself to you as an interface into the world. And that's where your magic can be placed. Just in that little tiny gap where you touch the world. That tiny gap where you touch the red hot coals with your feet is so powerful that you don't get burnt. And you don't have to have a frame of mind, you just have to know it's possible. And it happens without your brain even being engaged or without you knowing you're stepping on hot coals. As you change the interface to really cold water, a fraction of a second, your body can update just like a TV screen and change the whole lot. You can do something strenuous and think you're going to die 
But if you can see that it's possible for your body to, to update its screen, it will update immediately and put you back into normal action. With sufficient energy to do exactly what you did before within seconds. These are the things to play with, to see that you have capabilities that are superhuman. And they're done by simplicity. Whatever you see works. Whatever you feel works. Because you're the author of your world in every way. And our worlds do not overlap. They interact. They do not clash. They never run into one another. But like a magnet, the fields affect where you should be and what you should be doing. And you don't have to do anything about it. You move magnets, magnets around and you leave one to find its own place, it will. And it will find a balance. And it will balance everything else. And we are just like magnets. But we have a million polarities in a million dire directions. And that's that sparkle. It's just like the stars around around your body, like Tinkerbell. As you change one, they all change. As you interact with another field, they all move so that they can actually pass through one another and give you the greatest thrill of all your life. So you're experiencing another being in all the beauty that they present in the universe. So as you allow yourself to extend your field, you'll feel it becomes much more solid. You are able to, to touch it. You are able to push the field here and somebody feels it 20 feet away. And you're able to move things. But it's nothing to do with your brain. As you allow that movement to continue, it weaves a solid form. And it's a solid form of continuous movement. Just like if you pluck the string of an instrument, you can see the resonance. You can see it the one spot it stands still, or many spots it stands still, depending on the harmonics. We are masters of harmonics. We can actually interact and watch the harmonics create another entity that we can see. We can watch the harmonics act on another body and make certain that they have a perfect life and a perfect world. And that that interaction enhances everything in their world and in their life. And it's not a verbal interaction and it's not a physical interaction. It's an interaction of your feels that is now physical. Those fields are available to you and the energies are available to you to do what you like with. The only thing about them is they never run into one another. They never hurt anything. And you can't explode anybody with it. What it does, even if there's something that you don't consider right it brings it in allows it to sit where it's supposed to be just like the magnet so the more we get used to this the more we've got at our fingertips 
the more we can say to ourselves, yes, the only tool I need is magic and miracles. I don't even need influence. I don't need standing in the world. I don't need a qualification because I can sit still, smile and watch a person that doesn't think I can see them start to smile and feel so much different to what they did before I transmitted my desire for them to have a perfect life. You do not hold anything back when you're in the world of your creator. And what we're being shown is that you don't follow anyone or anything. You follow your own spirit, your own lead, your own connection with your creator. You don't even follow your creator because it's your world. And your creator is well pleased with it. And you have full support from many millions of entities and people. And you have support of everybody in the world. Because inside everyone, we all know that our interaction with one another through this beautiful field that we present as a majestic being. As we interact, we create perfection. And we actually have the ability to make not just this world, but every world, even the world of your creator, more majestic because of our presence. I often talk about the beautiful lady that walks into the dance and stops everybody and doesn't say a word because of the aura that she's sending out and of the beauty of her nature. That same thing can happen with a hundred year old lady or man. And it has the same effect. So now we all have a major influence in the world. Our input makes a difference. Our presence makes a difference. And our ability to transmit the beauty of our majestic being never disappears. From when we're children, before we can walk, we have this communication system working perfectly. We have the ability to bring things into the world through our parents, through our friends, that we have no idea how to do, or even what the name of them are. Yet, when you see a young child change the life of a whole family, You can see also, you can change the life of a whole family. And it's not the family we're talking about that I'm referring to. It's the family of beings who are here to assist one another, to see that the world and everybody in it and everything in it reaches the perfection that they promised as individuals in the reality that they brought into the earth. That family is rather large. There are a few who come from some other place. There are influences that come from other places. But as you affect your family and the family of beings who are here to raise 
the Earth star into the galaxy and make it a galactic star so that it glows just like they do. I, I, I lose track because it's so beautiful when I see the picture of what we're presenting in the universe. And when I see the picture of what we do just because we smile, or what we do just because we go, wow, that's beautiful. Or every time we feel good because we're off outside of the world and in the world at the same time. It makes the whole Earth system vibrate, come alive, lift you, and lift everybody around you. And you've all seen that when everything suits you. But now, everything does suit you because it's your world. The things were classed as not suiting you before, actually change as they come into your field. And you might see them, but you don't have to do anything about them because you can just smile and watch the, the whole thing dissipate into a beautiful picture with all the colours and all the dimensions, dark and light, and all the new colours that come from being in the right combination, energized by your field. This is what children see when they look at you. This is what people walking down the street see when they look across a crowd. And they recognize that you must be part of the original team. And for a fraction of a second, the communication is so profound, you never forget it. And you may never meet that person again. But as we progress in advancing our field to where it is useful in the physical world, we find that it all runs by itself. And that supercomputer that's part of your personality actually fires up and does its job. And it modifies whatever's needed to be modified so that you have a perfect day and you have a perfect everything else. And you don't have to do anything about it. You don't have to think about it. Because you're the master of your own world and therefore the master of your own destiny. So in putting all that together, you can forget everything and know that simplicity is the most advanced language of all times. Simplicity works. Simplicity works for a child. It works for the elderly and it most certainly works for everybody in between so as you simplify everything and forget about the detail you'll find your power lifts and your ability to feel everything around you and feel it coming into place really becomes obvious to you And the energy fields that you transmit into the world to do all the things that are needed, you only have to send once and then it's, it continues, continues forever and never ever stops. You want to enhance the general living conditions of everybody You've only got to see it once. 
then forget about it because simplicity has started to operate with your super, supercomputer and with the super intelligence of the universe and it feeds back to you continually and uses your being to measure the standard and the progress continually in every field, in every life and in everybody's world. So to top this all off, it might sound like something I'm, I keep saying, but I'd like you to accept my genuine, really genuine wish for you to have a perfect life, perfect health, and a really magic future. Thank you.